Hey everyone and welcome back to Prefusion. I'm Anish and today I'm back with another job notification. So the Indian Navy has uh, published its job advertisement. Okay, and we'll see it has like uh, it is inviting for various branches. So most of the branches are eligible, uh, whichever are like our subscribers are from. So we'll just go through the detailed notification and I will put the link to the website in the description below. You can go and you can join our telegram group if you have like uh, further doubts, like many people will apply. So you can also clear your doubts through there. Okay, so uh, like you have to have your BTEC and final eligible final year are eligible. Okay, and you don't need any gate score or something. Uh, so yeah, that is the three important points. So let's start. So mainly uh, there uh, like uh, taking these branches general service pilot all those things okay and in the general service be btech in any discipline is eligible you have to have your 60 percent minimum marks okay then you are eligible there are 50 posts and men and women both are eligible and how many maximum women are eligible they have told us told here and one more important criteria is the uh, date of birth so if you are like born between these dates then only you are eligible so you can go through this so naval air operations you can check like what are the minimum requirements class 10 and 12 also you have to have some minimum uh, percentage of marks and date of birth also you have to have right so all this you can check mainly like what our subscribers will be interested in is that engineering branch so engineering branch general service b b tech with minimum 60 percent marks in any of these following branches and you have 30 uh, vacancies and you have to be born between these okay so the date of birth are pretty stringent so like uh, just see if you are eligible or not but if like if you are born between this then obviously the competition will be low you can simply apply okay and electrical branch also you can check these branches are eligible you have to have 60 percent minimum marks and you have 50 vacancies so number of vacancies is pretty good and you have to born between these two uh, dates right so these are the things okay and uh, like after this you have to have a training i will talk about that now <coughs> just hold on a second so all these vacancies may be changed okay they it depends on them uh, and next is who can apply so candidates who have graduated slash pros graduated in the or in the final year with minimum 60 percent marks in aggregate or equivalent cgpa so minimum 60 percent marks you have with aggregated over all of the semesters and you are in the final year then also you are eligible okay or you have already obtained your engineering degree and you have minimum 60 percent marks then also you are eligible just few points to note a candidate can fill only one application you can he can give preference okay but he can fill only one application okay uh, so that will be thing and then candidates candidates must indicate the preference for other branches cadets also okay so if they want to consider other branches also there will be option you have to choose like if you want other branches also you can choose okay now like no other equivalent stream of b b tech qualification other than those mentioned in those paras i have mentioned right those are not eligible if they are if your stream name and that uh, branch mentioned over there are not same then you are not eligible just be careful about that okay so those are the things and you have to be uh, like you have to pass their medical standards so all of that is available on their website the link to the website will be in the description and then tenure or commission selected candidates will be granted a short service commission initially for 10 years extended by maximum four year uh, four years in two terms two plus two okay so you will be you will do 10 years of service and then it can be extended to four years okay this is the thing now what is the selection procedure so the selection procedure is basically first they will normalize your marks so if in the qualifying degree so whatever marks you have got in the qualifying degree that is your be btech degree you will normalize it okay for everyone and they have some normalizing formula which they have mentioned here you can check that and after that they will uh, like uh, give a merit list okay and then they will uh, consider for uh, like consider you for the interviews so they will call you for the interviews okay shortlisted candidates candidates will be uh, informed about their selection for SSB interviews, then we will call for interviews and according to the performance of the interview and the written test, you will be selected. Then obviously there will be a medical fitness also. Okay, merit list will be prepared uh, according to the medical clear clearance. So you have to clear the medical also. Okay, then training will happen. Okay, candidates will be included in the rank of sub uh, lieutenant subject to clearing of induction medical examination at INA post reporting. So you have to clear the medical uh, test and you will be given this rank. 
then obviously you're posted but initially what will happen provision period for ssc naic officers is three years so initially you will be in provision and for officers uh, um, other and other of other branches uh, is two years so yeah two years of provision for officers of other branches and for officers of ssc you will be in provision for three years okay but obviously after getting selected your basic pay will start from 56100 with other allowances so like those are good only so you can check and how to apply basically you go to the website and there you can apply apply all your recent documents all those things whatever is required so these are like the basic things that i wanted to say okay uh, for this job notification you can go to their website and check this notification further for if, if you have any more doubts okay so i will see you in another job notification thank you for watching and don't forget to like the video